scar scariest seeds in Minecraft. But are they really as scary as they sound? Well, we're about to find out. Starting with the Cursed Swamp. The story of this seed is actually really sad. Apparently, on this seed, a player actually, di actually died IRL while playing Minecraft. His friends say that a cursed part of him still lives on to this day in the swamp where he died. Okay, we are in a swamp, and unfortunately, I don't see Donkey from Shrek, but maybe that will change. But right now, what's important is that we investigate this scary seed. I'm gonna place down this boat and try to explore the swamp a little bit. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, especially if you've subscribed to the channel, I would really appreciate that. But so far I'm not seeing anything too crazy, no cursed souls or whatever. Okay, let's see here. We've reached another part of land. We are going to see what we can see from a different vantage point up here. Rumor has it that there is actually a gravestone on this seed. I, I don't know how to feel. <gasps> Wait, what's that over there? Stop. Guys, I think we found it. We have to go back to my boat so we can get over there. Um, did I, did I lose my boat? It was right here, right? Guys, I swear I left my... My boat is broken, floating in the water. Uh-uh, I, I don't like that. Somebody touched my boat. They touched my spaghetti and I don't like it. I guess we're just gonna investigate the gravestone on our own. <gasps> Georgie. Oh, guys, that's so sad. Georgie, hey. Um, uh, Georgie. So I know I sound crazy, but in order to, for me to feel a little better, I'm gonna go into creative mode, get an armor stand. And then a lot of leather. So we can act like we're talking to Georgie, right? Like we'll just put the armor stand right here. So first we're going to make Georgie a hat. I feel like this will make him feel masculine, you know? This is gonna be perfect for the armor stand. We're just gonna put the helmet right here. Obviously he needs all the other stuff too. So let's make him some pants, a chest plate, some boots, is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've still got it, baby. Okay, let's give him, is the water higher than it was earlier? Is the water rising? Ooh, I hope not. I do not want to drown. Remember, our boat was broken, guys. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh no, oh no. Literally, we're going to drown. Georgie. Is that you? Maybe this is happening because once I put the armor stand together, Georgie's like spirit uh, went into the armor. Okay, it literally just broke right in front of my eyes, just like my hopes and dreams. I'm getting out of here. There's, <laughs> there's no way I'm staying here any longer. I'm being pulled down. Look at my hands. I'm not even shifting or anything. Okay, I literally just got sucked down to the bottom of the ocean. I can barely move right now. What is keeping me? <gasps> what is that? That looks, oh, oh my gosh. Well, that's one way to do it. Okay, confirmed. This seed is real. Don't go to the cursed swamp. The blood birch. Old birch biomes are so pretty, but is it possible that they're actually holding a deep dark secret? Well, someone from our discord thinks so. And supposedly if you visit them at night, you can find out. Oh, I'm nervous. Ooh, this is so pretty, but that's not important. We have scary seeds to explore. So we need to locate this biome, right? So we're going to go to an old growth birch forest, just like this. Let's teleport, bro. Okay, so we are here and this looks very normal. I mean, I've never seen a, oh, wait. Never mind. That tree is like giant in the beanstalk. Billy Bean in the beanstalk. Jack in the beanstalk. Wow. <laughs> this is definitely it. Look how tall these trees are. All right, let's do some exploring. We're in a beautiful area. We're behind a pig and it's daytime. What could go wrong? <gasps> oh my gosh. So according to the lore, you must be here in the seed at nighttime in order to discover if this actually is true. So we're going to make a beautiful house. I mean, like pretty much a mansion right here. So we can put a bed in it and sleep. There we go. What is that? That sounded really scary. That was like, ooh, but in like bell form. Did you hear that? 
Oh, and it is getting close to nighttime. It is very dark outside. What it, oh, the sheep is staring at me. I mean, look how big it is. It's like almost half the size of this wall. I'm not crazy, right? Uh, let's find a normal sheep and I'll show you. We'll, we'll compare the sizes. Okay, buddy, come with me. <gasps> Guys, what? It's a normal size sheep again. Uh, you saw what I saw, right? Right, that was a really big sheep before. Okay, whatever, it looks like they're in love. So I'm gonna leave them be. Okay, let's do some exploring. Did you see that? There was like a scary looking Olay behind this tree. I'm losing my mind. I don't know how much longer I can. Oh, <gasps> there it is again. Why did I hide again? I'm not gonna eat you. It literally just keeps disappearing. We have God and anime on our side, so we must keep exploring. I know we'll be okay. What was that, a billy goat? Did you hear that? It sounded like, Wah! I don't know, I hated that. Guys, I really don't know how much longer I can stay on this. <gasps> Seed, I just saw the LA again. And it left a hole? Do they like to dig? I didn't think that was a thing, well, I guess the only thing I can do is follow that LA. LA, LA, LA. This has definitely been creepy so far, but I've seen nothing involving a blood burst. And a big sheep, but what is this? Whoa. Speaking of, I haven't seen blood birch. I think we just found it. I heard the same bells that I heard in the house earlier, and it looks like even the stone has been turned to blood. That is so disturbing. Ah! Oh my gosh. Okay, that thing has red eyes and I'm about to die. We have to find a hiding spot fast. Um, hiding spot? If I were hiding spot, where would I be? Y'all, I think it is safe to say that this is actually real. This seed is terrifying. I mean, literally, what could happen next? What scarier thing could I possibly run into? Oh, there's something behind me, isn't there? I'm about to get scared when I turn around. Oh! Holy cow! No! No! No, it doesn't have to be like this. You you do not need to be in this area. Please get away. It's safe to say this seed is indeed... Ah! Confirmed! Oh my gosh, it runs faster than I remember. The nightmare. Supposedly, something terrible happens on this seed if you stay up for, for too long. Now, I just get grumpy in real life if I stay up for too long, but... Right now, we're gonna try to do that on this seed in Minecraft. All right, so I've just gotten onto the seed and here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to find a village and see if there's anything that can help me. That terrified me. Um, excuse me, I'm sorry I interrupted something. Um, I'm gonna see if there's anything this village could offer to help me. So, honestly, this is a really pretty village. We're just gonna look around. What could help me? I don't see any red wool, but <gasps> chuckles! Buddy, oh my gosh. Hey, here, come with me. I wanna make sure you're safe during this video because this is a scary seed and I cannot have you turning into fried chicken. I've decided that this is going to be me and Chuckles' house while I'm on this seed to make sure that he is safe. Now, I'm sorry, buddy, I have gotta push you in there. Buddy, I'm doing this for your own good. I want you to be safe, okay? Guys, head to BreeMerch.com right now and get a dress-up kit for any of the plushies. Literally, Eloise could be a doctor. How is it already almost nighttime? I literally feel like I just joined this seed. Why are phantoms here? Guys, phantoms do not normally appear until the second day of no sleep in Minecraft, right? Like you have to stay up two days normally. This is just day one. I, I don't understand. Please don't kill me. I don't like phantoms. Finally, I got them. Is that all of them? Okay, phew. Okay guys, I am going to hang out in my house for the rest of the 100 hours, so wait until the end of this video to see if this seed is true. The ghost child. There's only one, one, one villager on this entire seed and it's supposedly a creepy little baby villager. So if it's a baby, how could it really be that creepy? Okay, so we have loaded onto the seed, but let's be honest, this is not exactly helpful. We need to get to a village to find the baby villager, right? So let's locate, let's go to the village plains. Hey, <gasps> I'm here, well, 
So far, this looks like a normal old village. Let's see if there are any other villagers, because like I told you in the lore, there's supposedly no villagers on this entire seed except for the baby. It does seem pretty quiet. I still have not found any villagers in any of the houses, but don't you worry. I'm gonna make sure and check all of them out. Anything in the chest? Just normal stuff. What about in this house? Normal stuff again. Are we ever gonna find this baby? That's my question. Unless, oh! did you hear that? I heard a, hey, like a baby villager. Knock, knock. Oh, guys, we found him! The tiny baby! Hi, how are you? My name's Brianna. He's not creepy at all. He's just normal. Hey, do you wanna maybe we could we could trade? Oh, okay. He wants oak planks. I've got you. One second. He won't notice, right? Alright. There is my first emerald. I feel pretty rich right now. I just traded with an adorable baby villager. Now, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I was gonna say, now what else do you want? And he literally just left. He's placed down a crafting table. What do you want to trade? A stick. Oh, okay, well, that's easy. So we'll just do that. Da, 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 da. Your wish is my command. It looks like he needs something more than sticks, which makes sense. I mean, you gotta have more than string. Okay, mm, you stay there. I'll be right back. I remember when I looked in one of the village houses, there was some string in a chest. Let's look over here. Oh, nice! We got some string. Let's go back to the supposedly creepy baby villager and, oh, what is this? Diary by baby villager? Oh, okay, I know typically it's very rude to read somebody else's diary, but right now we are investigating. This is for science. Day one, I spent today practicing my bow and arrow shooting with Frank. Who's Frank? All right, uh, day two, Frank wasn't happy today because I skipped a day of practice today. I tried to practice today, but wasn't very good. Frank was happy though. Mom told me to stop practicing by myself and to go play with my friends. First of all, this baby's British or something, cause in Texas, we don't say mom. But I'm thinking Frank may be an imaginary friend. Mom still doesn't believe Frank is real, despite me showing him to her. She apparently can't see him. We did some more archery practice today and I'm getting better. Oh, and then the story has yet to continue. Wait, also, hold on guys, look at this. It went from day four to day six. What happened in day five? What is going on? That's interesting insight. I think the baby villager has a imaginary best friend, but I'm gonna bring him some string. Here you go, buddy. I'll give you five string. So now he wants an arrow. I mean, he's just into archery. He wants to be like Katniss Everdeen from the Hunger Games. I mean, I get it. He's preparing for battle. Oh, hold on. I actually think again, in one of these little village huts, there were some arrows. I think that wasn't there before. Day five, guys, we found the missing paper. Frank accidentally killed a villager today with his bow? He said it was fun though, so he decided he wanted to kill the rest? This is going deep. I mean, is Frank real? Is he imaginary? Is Frank the reason why there's no other villagers but this baby on the seed? Did you hear that? I heard a scary noise. All right, we're gonna bring this baby what it needs because I don't want to deal with Frank. Hello, baby villager. I have arrows. Should I give a baby arrows? That sounds like I'm doing something illegal. But okay. Thank you very much. Is, is that all he needed? <gasps> nice. Okay, he's crafting something. Should I tell him I found his diary? I don't think so. What is that? It came from this direction. <gasps> Whoa. There's an entire like archery area over here that I promise you guys was not here before at all. Let's see. Oh, we also have another diary. Oh, <gasps> but this one is by Frank. I don't want to play with her. I only want to play with you. Get her away. Is that referring to me? Um, baby villager, you like playing with me, right? We'll trade. Guys, I want you to know I'm clicking. I am shift right clicking. I, he's literally not trading with me anymore. He's listening to Frank. 
Bro, where are you going? I'm really hungry right now and can't run that fast. All right, guys, so I don't think that this seed is is real. Yeah, there was only one baby villager, but he wasn't very creepy. Yeah, I'm gonna have to say that this is false. I did not see a ghost child. The game master. This user claims that there are zero, are, are zero mobs, but very scary signs throughout the seed. And I had to investigate it further. Okay, so first thing apparently you must do is change your render distance to four. I don't know why. And now we can just do a little bit of exploring. Since when have you ever been in the plains in Minecraft and not even seen like a pig or a cow or something? This seed is very lonely. Wait, what if I tried to TP nearby mobs to me? Let's try this command. No entity was found. Whoa, I, I have a fear of being alone and, and I, I don't feel good. Maybe we should find a village. There's definitely gonna be like a villager around, right? We've gotta find a village, right? Oh, <gasps> yay, I see it. It's just over this way. Nice, so we have made it to a village. That was pretty easy to find. Wait, actually, let me see if there's some fish before we investigate all the houses. Oh, remember the lore also talked about scary signs. What is this random sign? Play a game with me. Uh, I really don't wanna do that. I'm sorry, nope. I did not mean to click that. Are we going to die now? Nothing happened. Okay, thank goodness. I do not wanna play a game with whoever left that sign. Right, no villagers. I do feel slightly like something's watching me for some reason. All right, so I checked all the houses down below and there were no villagers, but I know there's got to be someone up here, right? I mean, come on. No, we still have a few more houses. Don't give up hope. This one. Oh, no one's in here, but we are met with a scary sign. Play a game with me, please. So it didn't work earlier on the shoreline when I pressed the button, but you know what? I'm lonely, what else do I have to do? <gasps> so I pushed the button and I've been transported to some sort of archery game? All right, this actually looks pretty fun, but I've only been given 20 arrows. And if y'all know me at all, you may know my aim's not the best. So wish me luck. Pacha! Wait. Oh, okay, that one's glowing. Nice. Okay, it is a little creepy that I'm playing some like scary seed monsters archery course. Like I feel like I'm being watched a hundred percent. Oh, come on, Brie. I was doing good until just now. Oh my gosh. Okay. Last. Oh! <gasps> okay! Whoa. Okay, so I feel like I'm going crazy. I've been teleported back into this house, but the sign and the button are gone. Ooh! Wait, maybe I try to play another game using that button down by the shore. It didn't work earlier, but maybe now it will since I played that first game. Okay, let's go for this again. <gasps> All right, we have some parkour. Guys, obviously whoever made this game knows me very well. I don't appreciate that this is over lava. It's not like a beautiful ocean or something like if I fall I die <laughs> not to give myself too much stress or anything you know we don't we don't want that who do you think is having me play this game is it the game master oh wait hold on I can see a sign right here but it's totally blank and boring just like blends in to the wall well done thank you so much um can I please leave now the seat is really freaking me out. Like, I, I really would like to retreat. No. Play with me? Please. Um, I already played with you a little bit. So, um, if you hover over, play with me. Look at that. There's like a box over it. I'm gonna click on it. Hit the like button and I'm going to click it. Wow, so we've been teleported somewhere scary. I love that for us. Looks like I'm in some sort of scary maze. Oh gosh, this is making me claustrophobic, I won't lie to you. I'm not gonna be trapped here forever, right? <laughs> uh, <gasps> Diamond blocks, well done! Wait, earlier the other sign told me well done, so this is definitely the same person. Congratulations, thank, thank you, thank, thank you. Oh, you win, or do you? Connection lost. Well, obviously this seed is confirmed. It exists and the game master is real. 
Okay, guys, so this is now my third round of phantoms, which means I am very close to almost 100 hours on this server. Oh my goodness. I have not slept in 12,000 years. Where did the other phantoms go? Oh, I'm gonna get you. Oh my gosh, I need this 100 hours to be up so we can know if this is true or not. Did I get him? Okay, wait, that means that 100 hours is officially up, guys. That's huge. But if I remember correctly, there were a ton of villagers earlier. I mean, like, I, I don't see anything anymore. What about my chicken? Is Chuckles okay? I mean, if all the villagers and things are gone, I surely, he's here still? He's stressed, so he laid an egg, but he's still here. <sighs> okay, so I just got Chuckles out of the house and he is doing just fine, aren't you, sir? I'm so glad he's okay. He was in my house. Whoa, did he just flash? Did his color change? Guys, rewind, I'm going crazy, right? He did not, he looks fine now. Right? Yeah, buddy, you look beautiful! No! Something is wrong. Something is wrong with my chicken. How is it already turning into the this... And phantoms are back and they're flashing! What is going on? <gasps> they look like skeletons! Oh, this is terrifying. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I need to defeat them. I can't look at this any longer. Ra. Okay, even the phantoms are going wild. Okay, die. Okay, I think that was all of them. So that could have been scarier, right? I mean, it wasn't too bad, and Chuckles is back to normal already. So maybe in order to investigate further, we should capture one of the phantoms so we can, you know, do a little research. Oh, okay, it is night again. I'm gonna place down this fence <clears throat> so we can hopefully capture a phantom. Chuckles is helping me emotionally over there. I have a lead, just need, oh, there we go. All right, it's flashing, it's looking scary. I've never tried to capture a phantom, so I don't know if this is gonna work, but we're gonna try. So we captured him, he's chilling here, he's still flashing and looking pretty crazy. What was that? I just heard a shriek and the door closed? What's, did something happen in here? What was that? <gasps> the phantom is gone! It was literally on a lead right behind me. No, you're kidding me. This is absolutely crazy. I mean, this was definitely a strange seed, that's for sure. My chicken started flashing, the phantoms were looking real creepy, but then they turned back to normal? I don't know, I haven't seen enough evidence to confirm that the nightmare is actually true. 